SEMA, my credit, my financing yeah. has gone up. It's gone up. It, um, I mean, we started what? When did we start? September, August, October, August? August, yeah, yeah. Okay, August, those two months are almost double than what I normally do. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. so. That's great. So it, 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 the ads that we're running, we're trying to, you know, get the financing. It, it is working. And, you know, yeah, we get a lot of the tire kickers are the ones that only want to spend 150 but sure. it has improved it has improved quite a bit so sure so it helps quite a bit well that's that's awesome so let's um let's maybe start from when we spoke when i when i spoke with both of you in july i think when you guys had seen our ad originally you, you submitted your information and i called you we had a couple of phone calls um and i'm trying to kind of remember you know, at the time you were doing a lot of Facebook Marketplace, which I, I, I think you still are. Yeah, um, we're still kind of doing that. But but what were you doing in terms of the follow-up you had to do? And, you know, what, what were you doing to try and get people in the door before before we met? I mean, mo majority of us through, you know, Marketplace happen to get the leads. Once they get the leads, I have to call them or text them. Basically, a lot of it's through texting or messaging, as you'd call it. Yeah. Um, then I try to get them to, you know, call me or set up an appointment and just, you know, back and forth. A lot of it is, you know, well, what kind of mattress and what size you're looking for and stuff like that. So that's the majority of, you know, the marketing was getting the lead in. Once you got the lead, then you had to try capturing it. So that was that was the majority of it. Now I did some other stuff from other companies, but uh, it wasn't. I, I wasn't happy with it. So okay. And so when when you're both working with with our system the way it works, can you talk a little bit about the experience of, you know, wh where are you kind of coming into the equation and what what's being given to you and? Well, <clears throat> I mean, your system is is actually two systems in one. Um, you're not only getting the lead, but you're also setting the time appointment up, which is awesome because that's actually, if you really go out there, that's two different programs you would have to get. And you are basically have two different programs, which is, which is really good. And, and you can contain it to how I want it, not in general. So, you know, it's like, and we've worked it. I only want to do it from this time to this time, no day on that. And you did it. So it, 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 that works good. And I like that because they were the, the two programs, I call them two programs, which is one, but you know, with the, with the point appointment setting and then with actually capturing the customer's name and phone number and saying they're coming in. I mean, that eliminates all my stuff that I have to do. I mean, it just, it gives me more time. So it's, it's, it is good. You know, we just have to critique it and get a little bit better on it. And, sure. and we have, sure. I mean, from when we first started. Yeah. And, and, I, and I think, great. I, for for me personally, and then I want to hear what you both have to say. But for me personally, I like you know you guys first off have been awesome with your communication. You've been letting me know you know when you want to make tweaks or changes or saying hey you know like I know we we tested Sunday for a little while and people were just not showing up, so we've taken Sunday back off the list. And so we're you know I'm enjoying getting to work with you both and figure out. <laughs> the system and there's duke the mascot in the background. Yeah, there's duke. um you know but but i guess maybe tell me a little bit about how you guys feel about that in terms of you know working it together improving it kind of finding out what works for your store and yeah i mean it, one thing you've made it is real simple to me and because you do listen and that's a rarity when you're dealing with someone on that third party uh, it is because they already have, this is my program. This is how it's going to be. Da, 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 da. Well, yours is more curtailed to what I want versus this is how it is. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah. And, and so that I think I, we find that a lot better because, you know, Ken will say something like, Hey, why can't we do this? And I don't know. I'll find out. And then I'll <laughs> ask you and yeah, we can do it. So it works and, it, and it's nice because it's, I get it's custom. How's that? That's that's a good. That's you made it custom. Yeah, to I, what like, I like. I like that. Well, and I think you know it makes sense because everybody's different. You know, you're you're all different. Everybody has a different way of wanting to manage their store, the mm -hmm. hours, you know, who they're dealing with, and um, so I think I think what we what we have is we have a system that we know is going to work to generate the leads and get appointments in the door. But from there, we want to figure out what can we do with you to make sure that 
it, it really works with your business. It's, it doesn't become an annoyance, you know. Um, well, I mean, we're in the right direction, if I feel. And we just need to critique it. Yeah. Let's perfect it. Right. We're, we're in the right. We have the two avenues. Um, you know, we're going after the memory foam. And that's going to work. I know it's going to. Yeah. And it's just well, a matter we, of getting it. Right. We've had a couple people in the door that have come specifically for those. Yeah. And it, and it is. And, you know, and we've had sales off it. Yeah. And so, I mean, and they're expecting, you know, just, you know, we're letting them know that, hey, you know, Tempur-Pedic. And when they know that and they real, realize that, they know or you're looking at $4,000 when we turn around and sell it to you for 1500 So. So actually, the, the, let me let me ask about that too. When when you first started with us, or and when we were talking back in July, um, you know, what was your impression in terms of who we were going to be able to bring in the door with with the program? Well, that was scary because you know we were going to pay so much a person as they come in, and it's like okay, my majority of my customer comes in, I bring them in with the with the hundred and fifty dollars, and I don't make any money on it, you know. So here I am you know, paying for ads and then going to pay for the customer to come in and lose money. And it was scary. I mean, I, it was, that was my biggest hurdle that I had, I had to get over. Yeah. And I still have that. <laughs> yeah, sure. Sure. I mean, you know, so it's, but it, 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 as you go, you let it run and it, it, it turns. I mean, it, you know, yeah, you're going to get the 150 person in and then it, it, is it frustrating? Absolutely. But then <laughs> it's nice when that one comes in for 1700. Yeah. So, so, but then, you know, but again, we, you know, we've changed, you have changed the yeah, ads like we talked and it's now, I think we're getting a more educated customer. Is that, then, you know, that's what, that's what we're getting is the educated customer that wants the that nice mattress that don't want to spend the 5,000 that was willing to spend 3,000. Right. Right. So that's, you know, that was, that's my biggest, my, was my biggest concern and still is, is getting that customer, you know, the right group that's looking for that particular type of mattress and that price point. You know, it's not easy for the, you know, average Joe to come up and pay a thousand dollars. The financing helps a lot with that, but. Right. Um, well, let me ask Kim, if you don't mind, uh, as much as I enjoy your handsome face. Uh, oh, sure. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> let me I'm not her. a speaker. I don't like to speak. <laughs> Well, you can still point it at him if you want. Uh, I, I just, I'd love to get your, uh, or Duke, that's fine too. Um, you know, I just he already spoke. To... What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> I just love to get, you know, your take on it a little bit, like what you're, you know, what, because I know you've been helping with some of the sales too and people coming in and just kind of wanted to hear about your perspective on what the people have been like when they've come in and, uh, you know, you've been able to deal with them. Uh, <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> yeah i have a hard time with this stuff is it is it different is it different from you know what what you thought it would be in terms of the customers that, that are coming in like who you thought you know might be coming in versus who you guys are actually selling the beds to yeah i mean it's they're more um because you pretty much know that they're coming in for a high dollar mattress before they get there so you're ready to show you know to find out what they like what they have at home and then you, you know, show them what you've got and then start, you know, combating it against what's out there at the retail stores. And then when they start hearing the prices, then it's just, it, a lot of times it's an easy sale. I mean, within five, 10 minutes, you're done. Perfect. So, so, it's helpful, it's over with. so it's helpful because you guys kind of already have a little bit of information about what they are looking for and what they're coming in for. It makes it easier when they get in the door, you can kind of start your your process right. mm -hmm. okay yeah okay um and what what is it um just in terms of the appointments and having like knowing that you guys have the appointments booked and you're not having to you know communicate with them really until they come in uh what's that experience been like or even from just watching dave have to deal with you know marketplace <laughs> leads and well exactly well i still do the marketplace you know okay. to get those low you know for the low dollar yeah mattresses you know for people that don't want to spend a lot of money of course and you know it's just when they get in the door you just we have to try to get them to go up in price and not come in for that cheap dollar one and but most of them want the cheapy that's all they want 
So, you know, it helps us to, you know, we still get those people through the door, you know, but then we know that we have these other ones that you're doing for us. We know, you know, oh, we've got all these appointments, so we'll be ready when they come in. Perfect. So it helps make, you know, make the day, you know, you, you know you're going to get better sales. That's awesome. That's excellent. Um, great. Uh, I, I appreciate that. I won't put you on the spot anymore. Um, <laughs> <I'll> <laughs> oh, you're, you do, you're doing a good job. Keep it up. <laughs> um, so I, uh, I did want to ask when, when we first talked in July, I, I recall, I, I recall you saying that your average ticket was about 500, 550 at the time. Yeah. Yeah, it was right around five little, yeah, right around there. So if I remember correctly. So I think um, I just looked at the numbers the other day, and I think in terms of the sales that we've done, people that have come in and that you've sold, I think our average ticket is thirteen eighty eight with everybody that's come in. It, yeah. it, it, that's high. That's right. That's <laughs> when, you, when you look at it, just like I scratched my head, I said, "Where did that?" But yeah, it's it's true. <laughs> it is. I mean, it, it has, it, it has helped. Like I said, it, it, it just, uh, it, I guess, cause they're more, like you said, educated and, you know, they're willing, you know, that's what they're looking for. They high end, you know, mattress. And so it's like, and like Kim was saying that when we just flip them right over, you don't have to step them up. Uh oh, did I do something? No, oh, it's yeah. It's, oh, it's, okay. It's, but, uh, it's I like mean, your ads, your system has hit a different, clientele you know that clientele that you want to come through your doors i mean yeah you have you have some that you know don't show up or you know people are just on there they're bored and they're clicking on it sure and making appointments but you still out of the day you're still getting somebody in and you end up making that sale you know unless i mean because most of them have already been out looking you know, right. so they, they know what those high dollar mattresses are, right? You know, so they, yeah. but then you, you know, you will get a few that will come through in a month's time that haven't even started looking and they come see you first and they're like, Oh, $1,300. No, you know, we're going to look some more. Yeah. And then maybe later on they might come back. Right. Usually, well, usually when they, they come in and walk out that door, you don't get them back no. and that, seriously you don't and and that's what i wish i could somehow we could advertise to where hey shop everybody else hit me last right you, you, they, nice. and one of the other things when they're shopping is they don't want to shop they're tired and they ah, let's just get it and that's what happens i mean they, you know i know and there's some statistics on the average customer how many mattress stores they'll hit and it's not that many i want to say it's almost like 2.3 stores and then that's it they're going to buy yeah so so it's kind of finding that sweet spot of wanting to be that that point three <laughs> that, that yeah. stopping yeah. Out last and making that yeah. that decision. Yeah. But we've also had I I I know we've had a couple of people that have no showed, but then the system basically works with them and has gotten them to come back in. Yeah. And even I I, I think the, the very the very first sale I think was like that. Yeah, it was. Um, the customer was in, and then it next. I mean, it, it did work them back in, and we got them, and they did buy. Yeah. So I mean, it, it works. You know, I mean, that's one. That's one thing I can say with the system. It works them. I mean, it, if it, they don't buy, then they either bought somewhere else or not buying. Right. One or the other. I mean, it's they're they're done with. Right. They're they've been washed and rinsed, and there's no repeating. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Um, so I guess uh, last last question, and then uh, I'll let you guys get on with your evening. Um, but uh, you know, if somebody's interested, you know, store owner, even, whether they're appointment model like you, or even if they're just kind of traditional model, but they can obviously use this, uh, but they're kind of on the fence, they're not sure. What would you say to them? I'd I'd tell you to try it. I mean, because you're not you're not tied in, right? We just did it on a, on a, you know, month by month. And so what are you out? Advertisement? You do that anyway. I mean, we're spending money in advertising. It's all Facebook. So it's the same. There's really nothing different other than you're doing it for me. That's less I have to worry about. And if it don't work, you know, it's been nice. Yeah. But it's working. I mean, I can't 
say it's not. And when you look at the numbers, like you said, my average ticket, it's just, I shake my head and I say, I can't be right. <laughs> yep. yep. <laughs> Hold on, my daughter just walked in the room. What's up? Uh -oh. Okay, I'll get you some more in just a second, all right? What? I don't have any right here. <laughs> on the phone. Can you go for a second? I'll bring you some water in just a minute. Please. <laughs> All right, let me resolve her water problem and I will be right okay. back.